Ah, uh, hello, what is up there, my beautiful people? It's your boy Juanito here representing Juan Step Ahead Fitness and very happy to be here talking to you guys. Today, I would like to talk a little bit about vinyl waving as well as a little bit about muscle fascia. So let's start by talking about your spine. Your spine is like the information highway, right? Your circulation is kind of like the expressway. That's where all the goods are being shipped. Your spine is like the information highway, right? So having a flexible spine also means that there's not as much impingement on the information that is traveling through your spine, right? Uh, in Chinese medicine, there's an idea that uh, muscles and organs kind of, so muscles, there's eight opposing muscle pairs and then eight organ pairs as well. And they're correlated with one another. And, uh, this is by way of the fascia, right? So the fascia is kind of like the stock of a soup, right? The stock of a soup touches each individual ingredient. Carrots, potatoes, celery, all of them are being penetrated and are suspended in the stock. The stock is your fascia, your circulatory apparatus, right? Your blood vessels, your digestion, all of this is suspended in the matrix of fascia. And the fascia is it's uh, organized by your muscles, right? So your muscles will change the dynamic of your fascia, change how it's set up depending on the activities that you most often engage in, depending on any kind of injury or trauma you may have had. So through resistance stretching, and Bob Cooley has a great book on resistance stretching that I would for sure recommend, put a link to it in the description. By Stretching in the way of pandiculation, which we described in another video really quickly, pandiculation is tensing a muscle to its maximum contraction with attention, right? Tension with attention, releasing with attention. You gotta be there for every part of it. You have to witness it. If your awareness is there, your nervous system gets the feedback, and then you can recalibrate the resting length of your muscles and thus affect your fascia. When you do these stretches, you can stretch out scar tissue that you have and have it become elastic and rehydrate so that now it's not impinging your movement the same way it was before. Fascia does have the ability to produce eccentric strength. So that means that it will slow down your movement in certain angles depending on how your fascia is, is configured, right? So generally, you can do more weight eccentrically than you can concentrically. So if uh, I was doing a curl like this, I would be able to lower more weight than I would be able to curl up, and that would be because of the resistance of the fascia on the way down in order to keep your body safe. So this is really quite fascinating because when all of the other systems of the body are suspended in the matrix of fascia or the soup stock, then by pulling on the muscles with our pandiculation, we can reconfigure the fascia and so perhaps improve our organ function and perhaps take impingements off of our spinal cord which may be blocking information flow, right? So you can imagine that right here, your spine is having a lot of communication with your heart or with your liver or so forth. You could think of the chakra systems that are used in yoga, but regardless, wherever those organs are located, there's going to be a lot of information traveling from the spine to the organ. Spinal waving is a way to keep your spine loose and flexible and moving in many different angles. So. My experience with spinal waving has been really good. I've been enjoying it so much, man. As I do it more and more, it kind of just becomes natural. I can feel it loosening up my body, especially in my hips and my neck and my shoulders. Hanging spinal waves, walking spinal waves, kneeling spinal waves, crawling spinal waves, and we will for sure revisit pandiculation as well. But there's so much to be gained here. So. I implore you all to take up spinal waving as part of your Tai Chi practice, Qigong, or just as a warm up to your fitness routine. It will really help your body to express in multiple planes the way it was meant to be. I'm very happy to be talking to you guys. <laughs>